So how am I feeling about KDP? If you've been following my channel, you know that I started KDP in December 2021. And if you've been looking at my income reports, it's kind of been a bit of a roller coaster. I didn't start making more than $100 until recently per month. And honestly, it's not going as well as I would like it to. So let's get into how I'm currently feeling about it. Grab some coffee or I have some hot chocolate here. It's a pretty chilly day where I'm at. So let's get right into it. So I'm overall feeling kind of okay about it, a little bit hopeful. My goal for KDP is to have it be a second full-time income or eventually be my only job and be a sole source of income for me. I do want to have multiple income streams. I think that's really important, but I really would love to be making at least $1,000 a month with KDP. So where am I at right now? Right now I'm making around $100 to $200 a month pretty consistently with KDP. That didn't start until June or July of this year though. Before that, I was making between zero to $100 a month. And I have over 200 books currently, and I've been doing KDP for about 10 months now. So it's been a bit of a journey. It's definitely not going as fast as I'd like it to. It is harder than I thought it was going to be. Um, so if you're trying to figure out whether or not to get started, I think you should because there's some people that get started and they start making thousands right away. Then there's other people who don't really make sales for a few months, but we all have to start somewhere. Um, I think that it's a business where you need to be consistent. That's kind of been my issue. I go through spurts where I will upload like 20 books within a few weeks and then I won't upload anything for like a month. <laughs> and I think that's kind of my issue as to why I'm not getting as many sales or making as much profit as I would like to. I don't really spend a lot of money on additional programs or websites, things like that. I don't think you need to spend money up front to do KDP. I think that you can definitely do free trials and just use free resources. So I don't really think that that's a problem, but I think it does involve a lot of time. It's not consistent. Like you can make a thousand dollars in sales one month and then a hundred dollars the next month. Um, but a lot of my income lately has been passive, which I think is really awesome. And what I mean by that is I haven't really been uploading much at all and I'm still making money. So to me, it's all passive income because I'm not really doing anything, but I did all the work up front. It wasn't like I spent five minutes and published a book and now I'm making all this money. I'm a millionaire. No, uh, I spent hours and hours of time and published a ton of books. Uh, to me, a couple hundred is a ton of books. And now I'm sort of reaping the benefits from that and I'm making some money, um, but I'm not making money that is going to replace my job, but that is my goal. I really, really want KDP, oh, I almost just spilled so much chocolate. I really, really want KDP and YouTube to be my full-time jobs and I want to start creating more items or things to sell on Gumroad. I want to get better with the affiliate that I have right now and I want to learn how to market that better. I would love to do some brand deals. Um, right now I'm not monetized on YouTube, but I am really, really close. So thank you so much if you're watching this video because I am about six to 700 away on my watch hours. So you watching this is greatly appreciated and really, really helping me out. So thank you. Um, side note, back to KDP. This YouTube channel is all about KDP. So I really want to continue both because I'm not sure what else I would really do with my channel. And I really love looking at everybody's comments and how you're all progressing. Um, I think the KDP community is great. There are definitely some people that can be mean about it, but I feel like that's with everything. There's also those people that are super encouraging, some amazing YouTubers out there. So overall, I think that KDP can be a great source of income. I think it can be something that is fun. I don't think it has to take a ton of time, but I also think it will take some time. At least in the beginning, it will probably take more time than you think. But once you have all of your books, it honestly doesn't require a lot of time. I personally don't run ads, at least right now. So that's not really a concern for me spending money on that or spending time figuring that out. So I think it really depends what you do with your business. Um, but I'm definitely a little bit discouraged because it's been so long, almost a year. And I know that's probably not a very long time for everyone, but to spend a year on something and 
only be making a few hundred to me is not a lot. However, I know that this is a journey. I know that it can take time. So at the same time, even though I'm a little discouraged, I'm still hopeful because if I can make a couple hundred dollars with KDP, that means I can do that again and I can repeat the process. If I learn to stay consistent, upload books, keep doing my YouTube channel, then I know that I can be successful and be making thousands, but I just need to keep doing it. Like the only reason I'm not going to succeed is if I stop and if I don't try because this business has proven to work. Many people do it. You don't have to have started in 2018 or however long ago. People are publishing books now and having bestsellers. People are starting their YouTube channels now and they're getting monetized and getting brand deals. And you don't need a ton of books either. People only publish one book with KDP and they can make as much money as possible. Like there is no end cap with KDP, which I also really love. Um, I am pretty excited this year. I don't know if excited is the right word, but I am making enough money with KDP where I'll, I am going to have to claim it on my taxes. So that's kind of cool uh, to see the progression there. But I think if I just stay consistent and I start uploading at least 10 books a month, that is my goal. I would love to do more, but I'm not sure if I'll have the time for that. I am very busy outside of KDP. I have a lot going on. Um, and I do have a 40 hour week job right now, a corporate job, but I would love to be able to do KDP full time and YouTube full time. So that is the ultimate goal. So I definitely need to be making more money. So I'm hopeful. I know this is kind of a bit of a rant, um, but if you're looking to start KDP, just get started. Like you're never going to know if you're going to succeed if you don't start or not. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. But if it does, it does. And the books are on there as long as KDP is around and Amazon owns that. So that's probably not going away anytime soon. Um, I think it's just a great platform. You can be really creative with it. You can help people's lives be better. You know, if you're creating books that help someone track their blood sugar or things like that, you can really impact somebody's life in that way. You can impact your own life by getting a second source of income, help you pay off debt faster, or I'm really looking to quit the nine to five, that's not my hours, but you know what I mean, and be my own boss, be an entrepreneur. I would love to do really KDP YouTube, some sort of marketing, some sort of course. I'd love to create a course on KDP for everybody, but I feel like I need to have more experience. I need to have more results in order to do that. I don't want to do something if I don't fully believe it's going to help people. And I want everyone to be successful. So I don't want to create a course right now. I want to wait until I'm making what I feel like is a good amount of money with KDP and where I think I can duplicate that with other people's businesses and truly help them succeed. So I'm really excited. I mean, there's some things that are discouraging, some things that make me worried, but there's other parts of KDP that make me very excited and hopeful and motivated. Um, I'm not always motivated, obviously, but I'm doing the best that I can. And I am so thankful for all of you. I am so happy that I even started KDP, that I started this YouTube channel. And honestly, it's been such an incredible journey. And although I'm about 10 months or so in, I am very happy and proud of myself for the progress that I've made and how much better my books are now. So I'm really hoping to continue with KDP and I hope that it turns into a supplemental second income where I could actually potentially replace my full-time job or at least have just more money to work on paying off debt and saving up and things like that. So I hope that this was somewhat helpful, whether you realize the same things that I do, or if you have your own feelings about KDP, I would really love to know how you're feeling, how long you've been doing KDP for, what kind of books that you publish, um, you know, if you're doing low content, high content, how you've been doing, if you feel it's going well, and your plans, I guess, with KDP, if you plan to continue doing it or not. I love to hear from you guys, and I love to know all of your different perspectives on KDP. So thank you so much for watching and listening. I hope you have a great day.